Zapped! Did you honestly mean to take an ancient and wizard power like this and turn it against me? You are a foolish traitor, Minna. Why do you defy your king? My king? You who do nothing but abuse the magic of your tribe? You must be joking! How dare you! Are you implying that my power is our old magic? Now that is a joke! This power is granted to me by my god! It is the magic of the King of Twilight, and you will respect it! My Minna, did you forget? That beast is one of the Light Dwellers who oppressed our people. No matter how much you, you may desire otherwise, you will never be more than a shadow in their world. You cannot consort with their kind. But if we can make their world ours, Minna, light and darkness will meet at last. Our tribe will take back their realm, and sweet darkness will blot out this harsh light. And that, Minna, is why. I need you. Not just for me, but for all of our people. Lend me your power. So be it. I will return you to the light world you covet. Link, you are all chosen by the goddesses. Go to the princess, lock the way in the castle. That princess holds the key that can unlock you from your shadow form. Hello, welcome back to Weekend Play! Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess HD. This is Drake Lord 56. To hear you're better off without. And wow, Minna is in dire straits here. Let us head on over to Hyrule Castle and meet up with Zelda. Maybe she can fix Minna too. Of course, there's 
no real way to enter the castle that uh, just by going through the front door. Thankfully, Telma actually told us a way in a couple of episodes ago. Through her bar, actually. So let's make our way over to her place then. And I see that wolf guy up there. We'll, we'll get uh, all of them that we can soon enough. Hey, kitty! I just hate this rain. I can't get comfortable whether I sit or stand. Even my sixth sense is trying to tell me something. Hello? Oh, <laughs> people are cowering. Hi! You've been following me a lot there, dude. It's really coming down. At this rate, today's meeting will be cancelled. Okay. A bunch of cats are following me. <laughs> Let's just head on over to Telma's bar. I think it's this... Nope, this is not it. This is the way. Hey, the door is open! Beast! Get out! Well, we ain't going in through that way. You there! You're Link, correct? That I am, yes. Yes, I thought so. I could just tell you now. I'm Louise. Do you remember meeting me in this shop before? Though I don't think we were properly introduced. In any case, I must tell you. I'm a bit puzzled as to why you look like that. Really, dear, you can't blame the humans for tossing you out the way you look. Oh. Another patient! You are certainly a curious sort. Please! Princess Zelda! This way. Here. Get her through that window. The attic is connected to the castle's waterway. It is an old waterway, though, so it might be a rough trip. Well, I suppose all that's left to do is to make sure that humans don't notice you. Alright. Thanks, Louise. Just get this box over here so we can make our way up. Yeah, you know, Goron that's uh, patrolling the bottom level there, and it's got some people sitting over at a table over there. Okay. Make your way forward. Hmm. How's it come to this, huh? Monsters walking in the streets of town. Yeah, so they already heard about me running around. What in the world are the soldiers of Hyrule doing? The Gorons are so much more reliable than they are. It's not, not even funny. <laughs> Minna's looking in really rough, rough shape. Her, her hair there is blue. And, uh... 
Here we are, and what's it in on here? I heard an acquaintance of Talmud's defeated the beast that had been attacking the tourists on the bridge. His name was Link. It sounds like he brought Talman or Young War to Kakarika Village. And here I was, thinking Hyrule was empty of men of valor. Oh no, I don't believe he's from Hyrule proper at all. No, my understanding is that he's from the small neighboring province of Fordona. This may be s may sound horribly elitist, but people who don't know the city simply do not know fear. Interesting. Future allies, mayhaps? Alright then. Oh, what is this here? No, oh, there is a Poe there. Hi. And... Yoink! Alright then. How many do we have? One. I did. <laughs> that's the first one I have ever collected. Okay, I'll I'll collect as many as I can. I think I'm gonna try to go for all of them. I'm gonna try to do 100% of in terms of pulses and the uh, and the golden bugs. Oh, th thanks for beating the ghost. Can I call you Doggy? I'm Giovanni. I became consumed by greed long ago, and sold my soul to a dark creature that did this to me. I can't move. I can't go see my girlfriend. My cat pet, my pet cat Gangle is frozen on my head. I don't think I could be more miserable. I have to ask you a favor, little doggy. Can you find it to defeat the twenty ghosts that lurk in the dark for me? If you think you can free the pieces of my soul from the ghosts that'll hold them, I'll be free. Oh, but it's raining out now, so I don't think you can go outside directly. I'll open the doors to the underground waterway for you. Once the rain stops, you can come back here by digging in the front wall where the cats gather. Understand, doggy? Yeah, got it. See you later, Giovanni. Eh. This is the way to the high rule of the town waterway. Filled with rats and, uh. Yeah, and water. That se all seems to be uh, in there so far. However, yep, there are some Skulltulas here. Let's see how we can fight these guys. Come on. Come on. We're back. There we are. Come on, buddy. There we are. And how about you, big guy? Come on. Oh, yeah, there's no real finishing move I could do on these Skulltolas. That was actually a lot faster. Alright, gonna have to burn down this web here. And, uh, there's some lanterns I see around here, so... Let's light some of these up here. Let's get rid of these keys here. Alright, anything back here? It does not look like it! Let's grab a fresh stick. It looks like we head on up there. I think that's about it for all these 
things I could actually light around here. So let's just move on, shall we? No. All right. You know what? I'm 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 curious. Bloop. <laughs> it actually worked. Yep. Let's see. Yeah, we dig right here. And this should lead us into the actual castle area. In the uh, area we should recognize. Yep. Good thing I am not doing the, uh, the hero mode or using the uh, the Ganondorf amiibo, because yes, I have that. Alright, yep, whoa, that was a lot of stuff that happened there. Okay, Midnight can, uh, can't exactly help us jump this time. So we're gonna have to uh, make our way up through- Ah, tight world rocket! Come on, up we go! <laughs> he's like, huh, well, what should I do about that guy? Oh, he's already passed me. Oh, maybe my friend upstairs could help. Yeah, that worked. I'll beat you back up top. Because I was such an idiot. Alright, back where we were. Hi, buddy. Yeah, you're a, you're a fair position. See ya. Ow! Don't want to be in fire right now. Got uh, somebody grievously injured here. Yeah, that was fair. Just making my way through these guys just so we could... Uh... Okay. This is... Oh, we're nearly there. Just need to, uh... Get through some birds here. Well, he went down far. Ah. Okay. I'm gonna wait here for a second here. And walk against the wind. And I'll wait. There we are. This is the way we need to do this. Hi, see ya. Alright. Alright. Princess Zelda, we we need ya. Right now. <laughs> Shit, man. Please, please tell me, how do we break the curse on this one? This is the one, you need him to save your world. That is why, Princess, please, you must help Blink. What binds him is a different magic than what transformed him when he first passed in the, into the Curtain of Twilight. It is an evil power. Our world is one of balance. Just as there is light to drive away darkness, 
So too is their benevolence to banish evil. Head for the sacred grove that lies deep within the lands, guarded by the spirit Farron. There you will find the blade of evil's bane that was crafted by the wisdom of the ancient sages, the Master Sword. The Master Sword is a sacred blade that evil can never touch. Evil cloaks you like a dark veil, and that blade is the only thing that can cleave it. Link, hero sent by the goddesses. Like you, I have also been granted special powers by the goddesses. Fine. Link, you can't... You can't get to the woods on your own, right? Princess, I have one last request. Can you tell him where to find the mirror of twilight? Minna, I believe I understand now just who and what you are. Despite your mortal injuries, you act in our stead. These dark times are the result of our deeds, yet it is you who have reaped the penalty. Accept this now, Minna. I pass it to you. We go back, Link. Back to Farron Woods. Zelda, I've taken all that you've had to give, though I did not want it. Well, pretty much saying we ain't coming back here so easily. Was it? You know what? First, I want to take a little bit of a detour here. Let's see your map. Okay. Okay, I want to go to Lake Hillia first. Just a quick little trip. I want to take care of something bef- No, wait, actually, wait, I don't believe I can actually do it. Actually, we'll beat you over Farron Woods. Never mind. All right, so back on the right track. Let's head on over here. Hey! It's that monkey! 
Oh, and we are marionette things. But they seem to be more just interested in us here. Let's take care of these guys then. There we are, that was easy. Did, did you save me? Th thank you! Listen, since you're so nice, let me tell you something. There's a really pretty wooded area on the other side of this cliff. I climbed over there, but when I tried to get deeper into the woods, those guys attacked me. What's in those woods anyway? Now let's go check it out. Thanks for the tip. So there's another section of the forest beyond this cliff. All right, Link, let's go. Yes, let's. Some quick uh, jump chains and uh. Hmm. Get rid of some of these keys here. And it looks like some type of rope walking as well. Really interesting to walk around in the uh, world of light as a wolf. Kind of like it. Yep. So th those are the real obstacles there. It's just those swinging logs. Hey, a hallstone! Easy, it's the prelude of light. That was a mess. Let's try that again. There we are. I don't know what the hell is with me with that first attempt. Let the teachings of old pass to you. Take sword in hand and find me. Although I've barely even done that. Alright, right there, huh? That is an interesting place. But I think I could get to there. And what are th so? What are those little, little circle things? They kind of look like timepieces. Really hard to tell. I'll figure it out later. For now, let's just head on in here. So what? are these woods? The Sacred Grove! Ah, another hallstone here, but this is different. Zelda's Lullaby. There we are, first try! I guess it can only work with so many notes. <laughs> and do so well. Got a skull kit here. Eh. All 
Alright then. Get rid of these guys because they're going to bother us anyway. So let's try to find where this guy went. Oh, I think I see ya! Hmm. Pretty much went the way we came. Yeah. Yeah. I was trying to work with the, uh, with the, with the wrong controls, because uh, for some reason I was still thinking uh, I was working with, uh, with a weird remote, because that's the, uh, Again, it's me being getting yeah, getting lost with not only the map but muscle memory. Hey, okay, let's see here. Try going up here. Hmm. Not this way. So. Up. Oh. Okay, this way. Go away, you bother me! I'll take that as well. Okay, he's up there somehow. I'll have to get up there. <laughs> Man, those uh, hit flourishes <laughs> just brought it down to a crawl! Alright, then where are you going off to this time, little bastard? Don't want to deal with your bullshit right now! Like that! Yeah, we know, Minna, the, the uh, dude's bothering us and we don't want him to bother us anymore! I get the gist of it. Okay, let's go back the other way. Kind of got turned around. Oh, how? Where do I go? Did I totally miss him? I think I may have. Yeah, man, I'm just gonna ignore you. Oh, I had to go a little bit further. Of course. That's what happens when you're not observant. Okay, he's right above us. This is looking more familiar. Sorry, man, I'm gonna have to ignore you for the large part here. And bloop! Alright, I think we've made it to the exit here. Because that looks like to be an artificial archway rather than natural. Hello, you? <laughs> Alright, time for playful puppy time! With your host, Wolf Link! Today's contestant is Skull Kid! So what we need to do is wait for this guy to uh, blow his horn again. And not uh, target the wrong damn thing!
All right, then. Now, get him! That's the way to do it. Round two! He summons five! All right, then. That's... <laughs> Here comes round three, which means there should be six of these guys. Yep, that's right. More puppets, more fun. All right then. Come on, I hit you. There we are. I went right through you, but at least I managed to hit you. <laughs> Bye. Okay then. And through here we find this place. I guess we uh, play Zelda's Lullaby again. Okay, rather infamous puzzle here. But it's not too bad. We are guardians of this land. Guide us to where we once stood. Only then can he enter the true sacred grove. Alright then. First order of business, get one of these guys into one corner here. Let's see here. Looks like the uh, one on the left is the one following us. Oh crap, I got squished. Let's try that again. It'll repeat like this until we actually uh, have a successful attempt. And they actually have to end up on the thing at the same time. See when we actually finish this off here. I'm gonna try going this way here. And if you imagine having them collide, it just bounce back to where they were. A turn will go. Here, I get closer here. All right, I almost got it. I almost got it here. With just a bit of finagling. And with one more jump, that is it. They are back. So let's go in and uh, see if the Master Sword can't do anything here. 
Go now to the sacred place, beast. We yield passage to the sacred grove. Thank you very much. Let us go. Eh. Missed the door entirely. Glad to know that the part of my brain still works. Interesting little trinket. <laughs> the sword has accepted you as his master. Always freaking epic. This thing is the embodiment of the evil magic that Zack cast on you. It's definitely different from our tribe of shadow magic. Careful! If you touch it, you'll turn back into a beast. This thing is too dangerous. It's probably for the best if we need to just leave it here, huh? But on the other hand, if we kept it, you'd be able to transform it into a beast in any time you wanted it. Yes, well, since Zan was kind enough to take the this to us, we should be thankful and use it all we can. If you need it, just call me. I want to keep a little profile, so I'll hide in your shadow when you're human. But I can change you whenever. You can be a wolf anytime you like. Also, thanks to this thing, you can work whenever you want by switching it into a wolf form. Hey, but listen, Link. I got a little favor to ask. Would you want to come to, with me to find something called the Mirror of Twilight? It's hidden somewhere in Hyrule. Yes, the Mirror of Twilight, our last potential link to Zant. Alright, Minna. Let's get going. But first, there's a one little thing I could I could take care of while we're here. Well, too, really. So let's first uh, head on over. Oh, thought there was something here we can actually get. Maybe on the other side. I hear twinkling. Where is it? Up oh, there you are. Hi. What is this? A male snail! Yep, this is the animal that Agatha considers a bug for some reason. Wow, and an erect chest here as well. And uh, you know what? Since we're here, can we actually go back to where we it came? I think we can! There seems to be something right here. This boulder is just a little suspicious here. So let's just quick blow this boulder up and see what's underneath. Oh! A pole! Hello! Didn't expect me to do that, did ya? Yeah, as uh, Meta said, we can change uh, back and forth between wolf and human form. 
And uh, thanks to the uh, gamepad, we actually have a one-touch button to do so. But, you know what? I would like to uh, uh, take care of that one thing I wanted to before I realized we couldn't... Uh, uh, since we couldn't turn back into human. Head on over to... Lake Hylia. And Let's see here, which way was the way to go for this? I think is it was this way. No, it's over here. I, I think I see it. Yep, I see it right up top of that cliff there. That seems to be what we're looking for. Eh, didn't mean to do that. All right, there we there we are. And we successfully figured out how to ladder. <laughs> okay, studying this a little bit here. Okay. There we are. Got it. Now this is uh, an original song, if I remember correctly. For the rest of this episode, I'm gonna actually like, go around and retrieve all those uh, skills we unlocked. I think we got all that we can for now. Huh. Place we cannot get to just yet. So we'll have to not do that just now. So for the time being, we uh, can take care of a. Uh... Hmm, can we get over there? I believe we can. But for the moment, let's head on over to, uh... Huh. I think we actually have to just ask Nin directly to warp the, to these places. So let's first take care of this one here. This is basically the closest. Although technically, they're all the closest now. Alright then. So what art do we learn here? <laughs> we meet again. You have a little more of of the look of the hero than he did before. Do you feel ready to earn your next skill? I certainly do. Very well, but before we begin, I must test you to ensure that you've mastered the last skill I taught you, the ending blow. Now then, come at me. Sure thing, bud. <laughs> Boom. 
Boom! There we are! Proven! Excellent! It appears that you are certainly capable of performing my lost art. Very well, my second skill is... The shield attack! Let it be hewn into your mind! No matter how well tempered the blade is, if a foe is clad in armor and bears a shield, the sword will do it no harm. When fa facing such a sh foe, you must use the ZR to thrust your shield against the defenses of your enemy, causing the feet to coil. Alright. And so, bloop! A <laughs> quick chop, bloop! Excellent! Open a hole in your enemy's defenses and use your sword to strike without hesitation! Although I did exactly that. The shield attack I've told you can also be used to repel an enemy's projectile attacks. What should you practice? Then repel my magic attack with your shield! There we are! Perfect! When your enemies assault the with your yeah, I cannot read! When your enemies assail you with projectiles, this is how you can defeat them with ease. Done! You've learned of the second of my hidden skills, the shield attack! Alright, on to the next one! I think I'll go to for the first one we actually unlocked in Farron Woods. Oh, I thought that was something. All right, so the, so the uh, this thing should be right in here. Or am I remembering uh, completely incorrectly? Because I, I am open to that possibility. So I think it's in Ordon. Meet you in Ordon, then. Might as well just go there. Like this, this is right frickin' there. There you are! I was ready. Where the crap is this thing? But here you are. <laughs> we meet again! It appears your efforts have begun to return some vigor to Hyrule, but it is far too early to relax. Do you feel ready to earn you another hidden skill to steer yourself for the forthcoming battles against more powerful foes? Uh, yes, I do. Very well. But before we begin, I must test you to ensure that you've mastered the last skill I taught you, the shield attack. Now, then, come at me! Sure thing, buddy. Bloop, bloop. Excellent. It appears you have are certainly capable of performing my lost art. Very well, my third hidden skill is... The Back Slice! Let it be hewn into your mind! A mere shield attack is no match for an enemy protected not just by shield, but by a thick full-body coat of armor. Such enemies are often focused on guarding against frequent frontal attacks. They often leave the rear unprotected. That is when you see out target and press A while tilting the left stick to jump and roll on your foe, then performing a jumping slice. This is the back slice. Now try it! 
Alright then. Blip, blip, woohoo! So yeah, it, it hit the A button twice while um, to roll and, uh, and press B to slice. Hmm, you carry yourself well! But do not forget that with the proper timing for swinging your sword uh, while you jump. The third hit of skill, the back slice, has been passed on! There are four hidden skills for you to learn. Do not neglect your daily sword training uh, between now and the time you come to learn the next skill. May we meet again. Alright then. If I remember correctly, there's another one uh, south of Hyrule Castle Town. Let's head on over there if, it's, if I actually unlocked that one. Although I believe I did. Uh, what is it, postman? <laughs> Trying to be a wolf here. <sighs> Greetings, Mr. Lake. I have come to deliver a letter. It's a letter from Telma. <laughs> well, um, my business is concluded. Onward to mail. Okay then, as I was doing... Hi guys! Just doing wolf stuff, don't worry. <laughs> Just a gigantic crowd going... Bah! Running off the wolves! Hi guys! Don't mind me! It's like people haven't seen a wolf before! Alright, this guy should be right around here. In fact, I believe he's just around the corner here. There a hole, although I don't believe I can get to you just yet, because you look incredibly deep here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't think we can actually do this hole just yet. Let's go over to Wolfie here. I believe this is the last one that's available to us. I'll have to check the mini map after this one. We meet again! The next of th is the greatest of hidden skills I have taught you to this point. It may uh, test the patience the limits of your endurance. Do you still wish to master it? Yes, sir! Very well! But before we begin, I must uh, see you to ensure that you master the last skill I taught you, the backslice. Oh, no problem! You just taught me just like three seconds ago. Blip, blip, blow! Excellent! It appears you are certainly capable of performing my lost art. Very well, my fourth hidden skill is... The Helm Splitter! Let it be hewn into your mind! It is impossible to circle around and perform a backslice against fully armored enemies that move swiftly in combat. Against such foes, you must first use a shield attack that make him flinch, but then quickly press A. You will leap into the air and over the enemy's head and greet them with your blade immediately striking him from behind. This is the Helm Splitter! Show it to me! You got it! Bloop! Blow! 
And that. A quick pat on the back. With a sword. Hmm. Impressive. Do not miss your chance to land a helm splitter with A after your shield attack. The fourth hidden skill the helm splitter has been passed on. Three more! What else you got for me, Boney? There are still three hidden skills for you to learn. Do not neglect your daily sword training between now and the time you come to learn the next skill. May we meet again. Alright, I'm gonna check the map just a sec to see if I missed any others. I'm pretty sure there is one more, but I'm not 100% sure. Yeah, I'm going to Zora's Domain because I want to make sure I did not miss anything. Because... I think the... The... Uh, the two more... we I know for sure we cannot immediately access. I just want to make sure that I am not missing anything. Although I am pretty sure I got this one. I just want to make double sure here. Because this looks familiar. Yeah, I got this one. So I think, yeah, I... Th now that I remember now that the... That the skill that I, I have just unlocked is is the one that, uh... Is the one I'm thinking about. So I am worrying over nothing. So I think with that, that'll be it for this episode. So if you like this one, hit the like button, comment on it. And if you want, subscribe. So until next time, see you later.